loves, bonjour, mabuhay, and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, hi, my name is Roma, and welcome. And for my returning subscribers, hi guys, welcome back, and thank you once again for tuning in. So for today's video, I am going to do an update review. So it's actually a six month update review and wear and tear of my Cartier Trinity bracelet. So if you want to know more, just stay tuned. Okay guys, so as I have mentioned, I am going to do an update review of my Cartier Trinity bracelet. But before that, I would like to let you know that I did an unboxing of this bracelet. I am going to put the card just right there so you can check it out or the link in the description down below so you have an idea how it looked like when it was all boxed and everything and yeah <laughs> so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to show you first how it arrived and then i'm going to give you some specs and then i'm going to show you the wear and tear of uh, the bracelet after six months and what i think about it after using it for six months so first and foremost, I'm just going to show you how it came. So it was actually inside this red box that you open like so, where there's a slit in front. And lucky for me, I have received the red box with the push button. I know that for this bracelet in some other countries, they just put it in a normal box cardboard box that you open but I have received the bracelet box <laughs> so when I you open it so you push the button and then it will pop up and then the bracelet was inside here and there's the card in there so it was beautifully presented here and then I also received when I bought this bracelet a travel pouch that looks like this so when you open it it has actually a cushiony pillow that you can put the bracelet around so if you travel and you don't want to put it on your on your wrist you can always use the travel pouch and then in addition to the travel pouch i also got the cleaning kit and in here in the cleaning kit just to show you there's the um, cleaning solution and then there's also the brush and also the cloth so that's how I have received my bracelet one when I bought it now let's head on to the specs so like I've mentioned this is the Cartier Trinity bracelet and this one is in the small model and if you will see in here it's actually um there are three rings in here there's the an 18 karat white gold 18 karat rose gold and 18 karat yellow gold and as you see in here it is supplied on a cord so normally the prior cord is in black but as you can see what i have in here i have the cartier red cord i'm going to explain to you afterwards the details concerning that and the width of this cord is two millimeters and the inner diameter is 10.7 millimeters and this one when i bought it it was 580 euros and now currently december 2021 it is still 580 euros v18 and then concerning the just to give you some history concerning the design the trinity was actually designed um is a design created by louis cartier himself and i think it was in 1924 and he actually designed this for his french poet and playwright friend who is jean cocteau 
and like I've mentioned earlier as you can see in here there's a, an interlocking bands of white yellow and rose gold and then the meaning there's actually a meaning for this three uh, interlocking bands the white one symbolizes the enduring friendship the yellow gold represents the loyalty or fidelity of marriage and then the rose gold stands for true love so now i'm going to show you the wear and tear i think it will be a lot easier for me when i take off take this off first so as you can see in here just to show you as i have mentioned earlier it's in court so you can actually really um it's in a certain way one size so for those who have larger risk you can do it like so or for those who have um smaller risk like i am you can make it small by doing like so okay and then as for the details in the um bands there is actually let me just have a look if i can show it to you there's the all the details concerning the gold are written on the rose gold so i'm not sure that you will be able to see but in the rose gold inside there's the details of the um, that it is in that it is gold and then the Cartier um, inscription and also the serial number so everything is actually mentioned on the rose gold um, band so as for the wear and tear First and foremost, concerning the band itself, let me just have a look. Um, I have worn this bracelet almost every day since I bought it. The only time that I take it off is when I take shower or go to a sauna or hammam and i take it off when i go to um swimming pools as well as beach and everything so those were the times that i took off the bracelet but other than that i usually wore this since i have bought it so for the wear and tear concerning the band just like you know in this distance i really cannot see any um big scratches i suppose that there are some it's possible huh? but there are some um hairline scratches which is normal since i am using it daily but other than that i don't see any really you know big dent so i think it's normal because as you can see it's quite small so that's a plus for it for the wear and tear and then another wear and tear is of course the cord so like i have mentioned to you earlier when i purchased this it was actually with a black cord but i have requested um to my essay to change it with the cartier red cord and she made it for me and just to let you know that when once you buy this specific um, bracelet you can go to any Cartier boutique anywhere in the world and you can you don't need any appointment whatsoever you go inside and you can ask them to change the cord of course with the cords available at that boutique what i mean about that is you do not need to bring with you the certificate or the box just go there with your um, bracelet and then you can just go there and ask for it to be changed uh, for example it starts to you know have some um wear like in here i will show you so the cord as you can see there since it is um in here as you can see it's quite 
used already because everything when the when I put it that is the part where you know the band is stretched but the band is stretching the cord so that's why in here there's quite um, a significant wear and um, for example for that I will go back to the boutique to request a new a replacement of the cord it can be in the same color or in another color that they have um, at the boutique so that is I think one of the good thing by having this it's a bracelet that will always be different because of the different colors of the cord but other than the let's say wear of tiny scratches hairline scratches and the wear on the cord that can easily be changed by going to the boutique and request for a new cord it helped quite well for six months of usage uh, but like i've mentioned i never use it when i uh, take my shower even though my essay told me you know what you can really just keep it on your wrist and take a shower and everything because the, it's in gold so, i mean 18 karat gold so there's no problem with water and everything and then anyways the cord they can always change it so you can really keep it when you take a shower and so on but since i I think for me it's because it's nylon cord I don't know I tend to take it off before taking my shower so if you want uh, or hesitating if you have to keep it or not in on your wrist you can keep it no problem at all so apart from those two wears that aren't really that significant I think the wear and tear of this bracelet after six months of daily wear I am really really quite satisfied and I'm just going to show you though how I put it because you can put it with the help of someone or you can put it on your own so when I put it I use I put it on my left wrist and then as you can see I have to close it but it's quite a hassle to close it so I'm just going to show you how I close it so I bite one of these two cords here uh, and then I as you can see like, <laughs> and then I yeah and then on the other side i know it's not very ladylike but that's the method that i use so i can close it by myself so there you go and then the only thing though is as you can see when you put it it's always you know up like the like so but you can also you know just turn it around so that it will be flattened or if you want you can always put maybe that's the reason why there's not a lot of really I mean dent or visual scratches because I tend to put it um, lay it flat like so and due to that it held up quite well and doesn't go you know against other other um, jewelries that I have or on the clothes so yeah um, as for the wear and tear like I've told you apart from the tiny little hairline scratches that I cannot even see and the wear on the cord but you can change it wear and tear it's really not visible at all after using it for six months and my thoughts about this bracelet well to be honest I am very very happy I know it's not a full um, it's not a full gold bracelets but it's very versatile since i can change the cord i have every now and then a brand new bracelet i can also if i want put a dainty you know bracelet and put this as a pendant on that bracelet or i can also use this as a pendant for a um a necklace so for example i have a necklace here so i can just put in the chain this um the bands and use the bands as a pendant which is also an alternative so i think that this the size of this band is really a very good size and very versatile to be used as a bracelet as it is change the cord and put another you know bracelet golden bracelet if you want or even silver color white gold or rose gold because it has 
three colors so it really goes well with everything that you want it to go with because it has those three um, color golds and you can also use it as a pendant for your necklace so there you go guys so that was my update review and wear and tear of my Cartier Trinity bracelet I hope that this video has helped some of you guys out there who are debating if this is the bracelet for you or maybe not I hope that it has helped you guys and also for those of you who have enjoyed this video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up it will really help my channel and for those of you who haven't subscribed yet don't forget to click that subscribe button as well as the notification bell that way you can get notified every time I upload a brand new video such as um, unboxing review like this also first impression and just sometimes a daily chat in my channel so until then i hope that you stay safe and i hope to see you on the next video until then see ya bye